Thomas Dickerson in studio is with us live here today. His album is called Calling All the Nations. You gonna sing one for us? Man, I'd love to. All right, what's it gonna be? Um, let's do um, let's do the uh, title track, Calling All the Nations. Sure. And uh, I may stick a little Spanish in there for those of you All right. who are fluent. I'll, I'll give my best. We've got some in the audience. I know un poquito uh, español. Uh, <laughs> uh, well, bueno, muy bueno. All right. <laughs> Gracias, amigo. Yeah. Dickerson live in studio here at the Praise FM. That's the title track, Calling All the Nations. Uh, wow, you've got a MySpace up, and you can uh, actually check out four other tunes right there on the, on the MySpace. But your website is thomasdickerson.com. thomasdickerson.com, or you can go to <coughs> callingallthenations.com. And uh, you can see some pictures from the trip to El Salvador. 
and uh, we're just excited. Uh, we're we're kind of launching a brand new ministry. It's going to be a nonprofit ministry that that basically uh, allows us to to go and do what we do. Uh, we've got some nations coming up like Haiti. Uh, we're looking to go to Kenya, Africa, the Czech Republic, and uh, the the mission is very simple. It is to go tell people the gospel that, that Jesus loves them and that they can know the Lord. And uh, and every concert that we do, we invite people into a relationship with Jesus Christ. So uh, uh, check out the website and uh, just I hope that you're encouraged uh, by that. Amen. Praise God. You got Smyrna, First Baptist Smyrna coming up on March the second. Uh, that's the the new the, the one of the closest one to us here. Yes. Uh, back in and forth into Rome, it looks like. So check out the concert tour list here online. Again, ThomasDickerson.com. I'm looking at his MySpace, and that's simply Thomas Dickerson. Also, lots to see and do, and uh, it's it's so awesome to see that you're not just a kind of artist that you know you take the stage uh, here at home, but you you're using the stage around the world. I don't know if Shakespeare really knew what he was saying when he said all the world's a stage, you know, yeah. but, but all the world is, is filled with hurting people who still do not know about the love of Christ. And your call, my call, yeah. is to take it to the streets. Amen. Absolutely. Amen. I agree with that. And, you know, if you're listening in uh, today, um, never forget that God can use you. He has a plan and a purpose for you. Each of us <clears throat> have different gifts. But the, the great thing about what the Lord has given us to do is that uh, the body of Christ works in awesome ways. And he really just wants your whole life because he has a plan. And the main thing is that he wants to use you to reach other people. Can you think of anything greater, literally, than sharing a message with people that will change their lives for eternity? And that is what makes the gospel the greatest message that we've ever been given from God. You know, and I told the people in El Salvador who are suffering, and many of the kids there are orphaned, and many of them come from abused backgrounds. There was a statistic uh, that was in San Salvador that 450 kids a month are kidnapped by local gangs from their families. And so there's just hundreds of kids that are orphaned in all over the country. And uh, I got to just talk to them uh, just about how much um, God does understand what they're going through and their suffering, that Jesus himself... Uh, went through things that that um, that we go through, and um, so I just uh, I tried to talk to them about that God is their heavenly Father, and that this world is not all there is. So when you're trying to talk about the gospel, uh, just tell people, tell people about Jesus, and, and never forget it, whatever you've done, the Lord can forgive you. He can give you a brand new start in Jesus Christ through a relationship. You just call upon His name and He'll give you a brand new start. And if you already are a Christian, I pray that you get ignited to get excited about Jesus using you. How does He do that? He does that right here in this community. He does it in your workplace. If you're a youth, He does it in your school. And uh, He just wants you to uh, share people uh, with people this greatest message, which is God loves you and Jesus Christ died for you, rose from the grave, yes. and He can give you a brand new start and an eternal life <clears throat> in heaven with Him.